Hi guys, welcome back to New Year Fitness. I'm Matt, and are you doing this 60 day to fit program? I am, you should be, and this is how it's going for me so far. So to start the year, I started this 60 day to fit workout program, workout routine uh, from James Grange. You can see that on health and fitness, uh, muscleandfitness.com. Uh, I spoke about it in the previous video and what I'm doing at the moment is every day when I do my workout I'm recording it and I'm making a small edit and that's going up on my Facebook, my New You Fitness Facebook, there's a link in the description below. So you can have a look at that every day to see what the daily workout was, including active rest but not total rest day obviously. You don't want to see a video of me sitting watching telly. So every day that's uploaded in the evening and every Sunday I will compile those into a one weekly one for you guys on YouTube and uh, that's a more in-depth slightly longer video of me talking as well as you watching the videos of the program so if you understood that brilliant let's get started right so what we've got here starting on day one side lateral raises now this is a 60 minute workout seven exercises with some supersets in it and it's a nice light day the uh, second exercise you can see is a one arm shoulder press. I've never done a one arm shoulder press before, but it works. It keeps your core engaged because you, you want to tilt sideways. Um, very good exercise. Um, these are all the same amount of sets and reps, I believe. The three sets, eight reps, four for light day. This is for rear delts. Obviously, this is a, a shoulders and traps workout. Uh, this is a high cabled face pull. Once again, rear shoulders and traps, never really done many of them. And then we get onto the Scott Press. Very strange, I've never done this, never even seen this before, but very effective. I don't know whether it's because it was that exercise or because I'd done lots of sets and reps of other things, but shoulders were starting to, to hurt by that point. Uh, cable Shrug, and that is supersetted with the uh, upright row on the cable. Simple as that. That didn't feel like much of a day, and it, to be honest, it wasn't much of a day. But day two, then straight goes on to heavy day. Chin ups, uh, wide grip, well, not wide, wide grip, but widish grip. Chin ups, uh, two sets to failure, uh, I believe that was. This is a 30 minute workout, only five exercises. Uh, bent over row, I think all of these are four reps, uh, three sets. Uh, obviously, more information down below for the link to this workout. Um, once again, heavy day. Biceps, uh, alternating seated bicep curl. Um, once again, four sets, uh, four, set, four reps, sorry. And then what I did here is I used a barbell for obviously bicep curls. That seemed relatively easy as well. I could have gone heavier. And so I was still feeling like this wasn't doing too much for me. Then obviously, active rest day came. Uh, I usually do running or swimming or something like that. But my uh, girlfriend Vicky had a better idea, so we went out driving, went to uh, the local shopping place, and bought these. So that was our day. Roller rollerblading. Never rollerbladed in my life. Never roller skated in my life. I got quite ignore that bit, but yeah, I got quite good at it. Uh, I'd learned how to stop, which is always helpful. Vicky learned how to do a U-turn, as you can see. Um, I got better and better at it as the time went on. Obviously, more and more cocky. Um, fell over quite a few times. I've kept those off camera. Um, but that was that was a great uh, a great day and very good cardio. Got very hot very quickly. Didn't expect it to be so difficult. But then day after that, day four, back in the gym. Nice light day again. So you're going to do two sets of eight push-ups. It's only 16 push-ups in total. I mean, that's that's easy. That's nothing, is it? So cable crossovers, three sets of eight. Uh, they're once again lightweight, um, and they were supersetted with bench press. Now this one I did wrong as well. This is supposed to be a dumbbell press, but it wasn't until I'd filmed it, edited it, and I was writing the thing in that I realised. Then incline flyers, very light again, three sets of eight. Um, these ones were supersetted as well with, as you can see at the bottom here, uh, the incline bench press. Uh, by now, my shoulders were aching more than anything else, mainly because I suppose the light day from, from the other day. 
uh, the incline French press. I've never done it incline before, but uh, that was quite effective. Uh, I love doing tricep work, and this is my favourite tricep exercise, the, the uh, rope pull down. Uh, once again, that's a superset. With the dumbbell overhead extensions, another one that I, I don't really do enough of. Uh, I got quite a good stretch out of this on the way down, um, but not much on the, the up, because the, the, the weight's too light. Uh, then tricep kickbacks, which is my favourite tricep exercise. You get a nice stretch in them. By the end of that, still didn't think much of, of the light day. Then, next day is heavy leg day. When I woke up in the morning, my triceps were killing me in some of my shoulders, so obviously it's working. Uh, this is my heavy day, four reps for five sets, which is, the reps, because they're so short, there's only four of them, you think it's uh, quite easy and you, you, you know, I'll put the weight up because it's only four. But doing five sets of them really gets to you, and you don't want to put the weight down, so you force yourself. So there I was, deadlifts, standing calf raises, there's only four exercises in this, and it's only half an hour, standing calf raises, then seated calf raises, which, uh, it was quite effective doing standing and then seated back to back. Really enjoyed that one. Uh, and my legs are still killing me now. Then day six is complete day off, which was well needed because my triceps were hurting. They still are a bit, now if I tense them, they hurt. And my legs hurt if I move in any way. Um, then onto day seven, heavy day, back to the same as day one, shoulders and traps again, different exercises. So as you can see here, this is a clean and press. Uh, I'm not sure how good my form is here, because I've never done one before. So I've done it for you with a, a lighter weight to get a, a bit of practice. Uh, and in the end of it, this is the heaviest weight I could manage. Um, what is that? That's, that's 40 kilos, the bar's 10, so 50 kilos. Well, it's not too impressive. But um, oh, I really enjoyed it, and I don't think I could have gone any heavier with it. But uh, yeah, I look forward to doing that exercise again. Uh, we're back onto the lateral raises now. Um, slightly heavier weight, I think, than last time. Very difficult still like, to, to go up much weight with an exercise like that. Same as this exercise, you can't really go too heavy. Um, this one I don't do enough. So, um, look how ridiculous that hat looks. Um, I don't really do these enough. Um, but yeah, very effective because I can still feel the pain there. Uh, and then onto shrugs. I absolutely love doing shrugs. I need big Tom Hardy traps. So um, this is what I'm aiming for. There's a bit of a uh, fuzzy camera view here, which looks quite arty, I think, accidentally. So, and that was the last exercise of the week. So, whether you're following this or you're, you're about to follow this, like I say, have a look on my Facebook, um, my New Year Fitness Facebook page. Every day I will be putting up the workout I do there. It's very, very short. They're only like one, one and a half, two minute videos. So not to bore anyone too much like I am with this video. But then for you hardcore fans that wanna see it in more depth and have me voice over it uh, like I am today, you can watch this one on, on the Sunday. I'll upload these. These come up on a Sunday and they'll be obviously labeled 60 days to fit, week one, week two, week three, onwards, onwards, onwards. Um, so, if you're doing that, keep it up. Please let me know in the description if you're doing this and how you're feeling it and whether you're enjoying it. Because the first three days, or three days of gym work, I should say, I excluding the actual day three, which was me rollerblading and falling over, the actual three days, the first three gym days, I wasn't really, I didn't think I'm gonna get much out of this. But I kept doing the program. First of all, you can't write off a program within the first couple of weeks. You've got to give it a chance. Um, and secondly, I, I'd said, you know, I was going to do this and I'd uh, put a video on YouTube saying, this is what I'm going to do. This is the program I'm going to start my year doing. So I wasn't going to give up on it so easily when I made a commitment to you guys that I was going to document it all the way through. So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you're going to give it a go or you're in the middle of it. Please, please, please get in touch and let me know how you're doing. Keep liking and subscribing. Spread the word. I've had uh, quite a few new subscribers recently. And uh, I'm not sure if you guys know whether this is the reason you've subscribed or not. But 
my uh, when I get subscribers every couple of weeks, I will uh, name you all or give you a shout out, name and shame you. So the other week, um, a couple of weeks back, I did it, uh, and I've had quite a few new people since. So I'm gonna really briefly just shout out quite a few people here that have subscribed to me recently. I've got Brent Reed, Judd the Hotspot Allen, uh, Dariel Lashley, Rob Teed, Mr. Bobby Graphic, I know you. Thanks for subscribing, man. Uh, I've got one here, N-O, random. Caitlin J, Brent Page, Joe Van Vlack, Ronnie E. Rodriguez, that's a great name, it's gotta be Spanish, it's gotta be. Uh, Dennis Nuba, now this guy, he's got a channel, he, oh, he's amazing, you've got to look up this guy. Uh, I've been chatting to him for ages, and uh, we're going really well, it's really, he's a good guy. Uh, Alex, uh, ooh, Alex Berenger, sorry if I've got that wrong, Mohamed uh, Al Jabati, Leon Birch, Jim Heads, I gave them a shout out on, on Twitter uh, a couple of weeks back, a couple of days back. Um, they're great guys, uh, give them a look, Jim Heads. Nicholas Sams, Maxie Hopkins, the adorable nerd, she does look adorable. Uh, Tony Lai, or Lai, not sure how to pronounce that. I've been chatting to this guy for a couple of weeks now, just about stuff. It's not even fitness related, some of it. You know, getting to know him as a person. Uh, he's all the way in Canada, and I'm in Spain, so um, he's jealous about the sun, and, and I really want to go to Canada. But um, yeah, we're getting on really well, he's a great bloke. Uh, Joanne Schofield, I know you as well. Nice to have you here. Mike Arnold, um, here's a strange one. Sorry if I offended. Uh, Trollo McTroll, probably not a real name. If it is, it's very impressive, and I'd like to see a driving license, please. Sergio MZ. Uh, Yvonne Myers, I know you, hello. Mustafa Mani and Ricardo Chavez. So, thanks very much for you people for recently subscribing to me. Please spread the word. If all of you people that I've just read out can get someone else to subscribe, I'll be a very happy boy. But for everyone else out there, subscribe. Um, I'm gonna leave um, descriptions to the workout and all of my social media in the description below. So, hope to see you again uh, next week or during the week on Facebook. Thanks very much for watching, guys.